So it seems everyone's talking about this new application on Steam called Lossless and Upscaling and what does it do and is it any good? Well in this video we're going to find out. So without further delay, let's dive in. So first of all, what does it claim to actually do? Well there's two things, it says it can upscale your image and of course it does frame generation. So basically what that means is if you've got a game and it's running at 60 FPS but you have a 120 Hz monitor and you want to take advantage of that, you'll be able to set it to double your frame rate so that 60 FPS is now 120. But it also allows you to triple or quadruple your frame rate. So that's what we're going to be looking at today. So I'm going to be using Black Myth Wukong to actually test this and I'm going to be testing it on two devices. The PC behind me, which is a relatively high spec PC with an AMD Ryzen CPU and an RTX 3070 graphics card. So not top, top, top of the range, but a pretty decent gaming PC nonetheless. But we're also going to be testing it on the Lenovo Legion Go, which is basically a Windows 11 handheld, very much similar to the ROG Alley. So the first thing we'll do is we'll jump on over to the PC, have a look at the app itself, have a quick look at the settings that you can change, and then we'll start testing some gameplay, etc. So as you can see, this is the Steam store page for lossless scaling and it pretty much goes over what the software can do. Now, the best part about this is it's only £5.89, which is around about seven bucks. So it's not very expensive at all. So opening up the software, as you can see, we've got lots of options. Now, of course, you can copy the options that I've got here, but I'm going for a two times boost in FPS. So if I get 60 FPS, this should double it and give me 120. So as I said, we're going to be testing with the game Black Myth Wukong because everyone's talking about this game and it's actually really good fun. So first of all, we're on the PC. Now I have a relatively powerful PC with a Ryzen 7 5800X, 32 gigs of RAM and of course an RTX 3070. But with the current settings that I have, I'm getting about 50, 52 FPS, as you can see in the top left. Now, what you can see after the forward slash is what lossless scaler is actually outputting. It's managing to generate double the frame rate from the original. So kind of slotting in generated frames in between two frames. So it's basically giving us 111, 100, sort of 15 FPS. Whatever the original is, it's going to double it. And you can really tell it's a lot smoother and the game just feels a lot quicker. Now, for me on the PC, it doesn't really matter too much. As I said, I've got a 3070. I can lower the settings and I can get the 120 FPS without the software. But what about something that just can't produce those kind of frames and it never will, no matter how low you put the settings. So the Lenovo Legion Go or the ROG Alley, for example, they've got built in GPUs, just like the Steam Deck. So let's see how this game runs on the Lenovo Legion Go. So I must admit, I was actually quite surprised because the Lenovo Legion Go handled this game really well, even without the lossless scaling. But as you can see, we're getting mid 40s here, which in my eyes is actually quite playable. But it's really nice to see that we're getting 80, 90, even over 100 FPS on occasions. So this game is perfect for playing on the Legion Go and of course the ROG Alley is also going to get similar performance increases. Now I'm not going to lie I was really skeptical at first because just a little piece of software a little app is going to double or triple your frame rate basically saving you from going out and upgrading your graphics card sooner rather than leaving it for a bit longer. Now I do want to give a massive shout out to Bike Bob for introducing me to the software because 
Using the Legion Go, everybody knows those iGPUs, they're not the most powerful things. So getting higher refresh rates usually means dumbing the settings down to the lowest that they can go. But now I don't have to. So thank you, Bike Bob, you're a legend. So what more can I say? This software is amazing. And for under £10, 10 bucks, I think it's actually around five pound and about six seven bucks it's absolutely nothing to gain so much more performance essentially it's a really good piece of software and i think everyone should have it in their steam library so i think i'm going to end the video here but if you enjoy my content you know what to do like the video smash the subscribe button and give that bell a little tinkle so you don't miss any future uploads i'm jp You've been watching Alien Gaming, and as always, I'll catch you in the next one.